This video will be showing how to migrate a BioConnect SQL database to a new server, as well as how to upgrade BioConnect. Before the support video starts, we'd like to introduce you to BioConnect Insights. Do your biometric devices ever encounter networking issues? BioConnect Insights is a new feature within BioConnect Enterprise that identifies these issues early on, allowing your organization to restore normal device and network operations before system use is hindered. Feel free to ask your technical services advisor about Insights or check out our YouTube page for a demonstration. First, you'll want to back up your BioConnect database. You will need to use SQL Management Studio. If you don't have SQL Management Studio, we recommend installing the 2012 version. You can find a link to download the software in the description. Once it is installed, search and open SQL Server Management Studio as an administrator. Connect to the SQL instance where your BioConnect database is located. Click the plus next to databases. Right click on your BioConnect database. By default, it is named BioConnect, but you may have changed it in the setup assistant. Go to tasks and then click on backup. Here, you can configure the settings for your backup. To choose a destination folder for the backup, first make sure that there are no destinations already present. If there is a destination present, select it and click remove. To add a destination, make sure disk is selected and then click on add in the destination section. Click on the ellipses. Select a folder to save the backup to. Name the file bioconnect underscore backup underscore date underscore brief description dot back. Take note of the folder you choose. You will need to find it later to locate your backup. When you are ready, Click OK. Click OK. Click OK to begin the backup. When the backup is complete, click OK. If you are migrating your database to a new server, you will need to copy this file to your new server. If you are migrating, skip to this timecode. If you aren't migrating BioConnect and are only upgrading, you will first need to uninstall BioConnect. Open Control Panel and go to Uninstall a program. Select BioConnect and click Uninstall. Click Yes. Next, uninstall the BioConnect networking tool. Finally, uninstall Suprema Fingerprint Scanner Driver. Click Yes. Click Finish. Your computer will restart. Skip to this timecode. On your new server, open SQL Management Studio as an administrator. Again, links to download the software can be found in the description. Connect to the SQL instance where you would like to install the BioConnect database. Right-click on Databases and select Restore Database. In the Source section, select Device. Click on the ellipsis. Click Add. Select the backup file you created earlier and click OK. Click OK. Under Destination, beside Database, the name of the database you backed up should appear. If it doesn't, enter its name in this box. Make sure the checkbox under Restore is selected and click OK. Click OK. Next you'll need to install BioConnect. For instructions on how to install BioConnect, links to server installation videos can be found in the description. However, there will be a couple of key differences between the steps in those videos and the steps you should take when migrating or upgrading. The first difference occurs in step three of the setup assistant. This change only occurs if you are migrating to a new server. If you are upgrading on the same server, please skip to this timecode. You will need to email BioConnect support to request a new license since your old license is tied to your old computer's MAC address. Our email address is support at bioconnect.com. Indicate that you are migrating BioConnect to a new server. Indicate whether or not the new server has an internet connection so we know whether to provide you with an online or offline license. Provide the MAC address of your computer 
and your activation ID. If you don't know your MAC address, please watch our video on licensing BioConnect. Before sending this email, make sure that you are no longer using your old server. BioConnect will reset your license, meaning that the license on your old computer will be reset to a trial license and will only be able to support one device. When you are ready, send the email. BioConnect will either provide you with an offline license or let you know that your license has been reset, in which case you can use your activation ID with the online license option. For more information on licensing BioConnect, please watch our video on obtaining and expanding licenses. The next difference comes at step five. Make sure you select custom installation. Besides server name, enter the name of the server instance where your BioConnect database is located. If you are migrating BioConnect, this is the instance where you just restored the database. Beside database, enter the name of your database. Unless you change the name of the database sometime during this process, it should still be BioConnect. When you are ready, click Test. Click OK. Click Update. Click OK. Click Next. For more help, please visit support.bioconnect.com and check out our other videos.